hi guys welcome to my channel thank you so much for coming back today's video is going to be all about how i wash my hair and also to promote hair growth so if you'd like to see how i am able to do this and to grow my hair healthy and long please stay tuned for the video and for those of you who are new to my channel my name's joy Nwaba. and on this channel i talk about natural hair i also talk about gray hair in hopes of inspiring other women who are prematurely graying to feel comfortable in their own hair and also i talk about beauty lifestyle i do little vlogging in fact i talk about a little about everything so if you'd like to join the family just go ahead and hit that subscribing button down below and also hit the notification bell so you will not miss any videos from me again with that being said let's get into the video so family before now i have already prepared my hair with aloe vera gel and almond oil so i left it in there for a few hours now it's time to wash off the treatment so guys to shampoo my hair i'm going to be using my regular shampoo and i'll also condition my hair and also i'm going to do rice water rinse and after i will follow it up with almond oil to keep my hair soft and shiny after shampoo so guys the benefits of rice water is it helps to remove dandruff strengthens the strands stimulates hair growth it gives vitality and significantly improves hair appearance and it's also very rich in vitamin especially b and c okay so i have already washed off the treatment without shampoo and now i'm going in with the shampoo we know that it is our scalp that needs the shampoo okay so the rest of the hair when you are pouring water on the hair it's also clean so make sure to take time to scrub your scalp while shampooing to get off the dirt so as you can see i am shampooing my hair right now and just keep watching okay guys so this is what i usually do before washing my hair i like washing my hair in braids and also i section it before washing with this the hair is more manageable and less breakage so if you are the type that have lots of breakage and tangles after washing your hair consider washing your hair in braids and sections while washing so guys that section has been prepared and it's clean now i'll go over to the other section so and i am simply repeating the same thing i'll first of all wash the product without shampoo after that i'll go in with my shampoo so guys in case you are wondering what i am looking at i'm simply watching from the mirror okay yes to see what i'm doing the shampooing process is over my hair is shampooed and clean now i'm going in with my conditioner you use what works for you okay yes because what works for you might not work for me and the other way around so you use what works best for you so where you want the conditioner is basically on the strands of the hair and working it through and I'm just being generous to make sure I get a true strands. Yeah. 
yes i'm just being generous with the product so if you need more go ahead and add okay and make sure you get it through all the strands Yeah, guys this is my rice water i just made it so if you'd like to know how i do this let me know at the comment section so i can <laughs> let you guys know how i prepare my own rice water okay yes and i'm going to use that later okay after i have rinsed my hair from the conditioner So family, what I'm doing right now is to lose my hair from the braids to allow the water to cleanse the hair more. So after that, I'm going to apply my rice water. So keep watching guys. Thank you so much for watching up to this time. I do really appreciate. So I'm going in with my rice water. Oh my God, it feels so cold. I just brought it out from the fridge and... Um, Oh my god i literally like how my hair feels right now i'm just separating and making sure i get the water through all the strands and amazingly oh my god i like how my hair feels yeah it feels so together if you have not used rice water on your natural hair try to use it okay it works i i, I like how my hair feels and um if you're wondering or it breaks your hair because when i started using it i feel my hair breaks because i will apply the rice water and leave it in for a while but right now i have realized that my hair doesn't like that what i'm doing is i use it for rinse then immediately i wash it off it's it still feels good it still does the job yeah for me yes that's the new way i have started incorporating rice water on my natural hair so guys the other side is done now i'll go over to this side i will basically repeat the same thing yeah i will lose the braids to make sure i get the rice water through my hair evenly how do you apply rice water on your hair let me know at the comment section okay because we learn every day yours might be better oh can you see how my hair looks it looks so soft and bouncy yeah so this is the last thing i'm going to do to my hair and that is applying mm -hmm. almond oil almond oil softens my hair and i don't know i just realized that after so many years of being natural since i started incorporating almond oil to my hair my hair has stopped breaking unnecessarily i use it to detangle my hair and do a lot of things to my hair almond oil works amazingly for my own 4c natural hair I don't know about you, 
but if you don't mind let me know the oil that works for you at the comment section and thank you for doing that So after applying the almond oil and massaging it through my strands, making sure I get it all in there, I'll rinse the hair. And that will be all for my wash day. And I'll twist my hair up. This will keep my hair away from shrinkage and tangles. And after that, I will wrap my hair with my t-shirt. Yes. Okay guys, so that will be all from me today. Thank you so much for watching up to this time. I really appreciate it. I love you guys and I hope this helps someone. If you did like this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't joined the family, go ahead and hit the subscribing button down below. Also hit the bell notification so you will never going to miss another videos from me again. If this video was helpful to you, it could also be to another person. So go ahead and share. As always, thanks for watching. And I will see you all in my next one. Bye.